In other news, Korea's state-run electric power corporation rolls out self-rescue measures over mounting deficit prior to its CEO has offered to resign. Next week, the government will likely announce rate hikes. Our Lee Dae-yeon reports. South Korea's state-run power company Korea Electric Power Corporation on Friday released measures to overcome its ballooning deficit. Through this plan, KEPCO aims to have saved more than 25 trillion won, or almost 19 billion U.S. dollars by 2026. Part of its self-rescued measures include selling its southern Seoul headquarters in the financial district of Yoido, as well as other buildings owned by its affiliates. Freezing the wages of their employees was also brought up. High-ranking officials will return some of their pay rises from this year so that this money can be used to support low-income households struggling to pay their utility bills. The company plans to sit down with the labor union to talk about all 23,000 KEPCO workers joining the move to freeze wages or return raises. It will also reorganize the company's structure to reduce expenses while postponing some of its construction plans for electricity facilities. KEPCO has logged a huge deficit of around $142 billion due to soaring energy prices and limited electricity rate hikes amid high inflation. One official says it will implement these measures as early as possible to overcome the financial crisis. Meanwhile, the chief of KEPCO, Chong sin il offered to resign on the same day, taking responsibility for the mounting losses of the company. The Korea Gas Corporation, too, announced cost-cutting measures such as freezing the wages of senior officials, as up until March, the company had $8.6 billion worth of uncollected payments. Following these decisions, the government will be making the announcement on the second quarter utility bills decision next Monday. According to forecasts made by the government and industry insiders, electricity rates are expected to be raised by 7 won per kilowatt. With this raise, a family of four will be paying an average of around $1.8 more. Household gas prices are forecasted to be raised by about 5.41 per megajoule. Lee Dae-hyun, Arirang News.